Hello everyone, we are going to be looking more at Hurricane Delta and how it could lead some major impacts to Louisiana and the surrounding states. However, before we could get into the forecast, be sure to subscribe to the channel if you are new and turn on post notifications so you won't miss a single upload or live stream. Right now, we are currently looking at the cone of uncertainty for Hurricane Delta, major Hurricane Delta as of this afternoon. As you can see right now, it is current just east of Mexico. We do we currently do have hurricane warnings in the red shaded areas right there. We also do have tropical storm warnings in effect for the blue areas as well. Still a major hurricane by the time it makes landfall on Mexico. And then by 2 a.m. Friday approaching Louisiana coastline. And then 2 p.m. Friday, still a major hurricane and then making landfall as a category 3. This definitely could strengthen even into a category 5. We are getting into that point about 145 miles per hour. And the category 5 is somewhere around 150. So very close. We're getting to that point. We are uh, seeing very rapid intensification. Uh, just yesterday, it was a tropical storm. So definitely a very, this is kind of what we saw with Laura here is we saw a tropical storm uh, one night and then the next night we saw a major category four hurricane make a landfall. So that's kind of, uh, we're seeing a very well looking Laura storm right here. Then becoming a tropical storm by 2 p.m. Saturday and then 2 p.m. Sunday becomes a post tropical cyclone. Now the U.S. rainfall potential, we are already seeing 6 to 10 inches of rainfall possible in those orange shaded areas. That's going to be bring some major flooding for some of these areas here that were affected by Laura. You can also see around 4 to 6 inches of rainfall. You only really need 3 inches of rainfall for some minor flash flooding. So we are going to see lots of rainfall, meaning we may see some major flash flooding in some of these areas. There's going to be a lot of flash flooding um, warnings and watches. Uh, beforehand for these types of areas as the rainfall will actually increase depending on the forecast for the next couple of days before this makes landfall so this is not the final forecast once this approaches the Louisiana coastline we will have the final forecast for that rainfall but this is kind of the early look of what we can see for Hurricane Delta so Definitely a lot of rainfall is expected for Louisiana, Mississippi, um, maybe Texas could see some a, a bit of rainfall here, two to four inches of rainfall for some of the eastern Texas areas. Alabama could see two to four inches of rainfall mainly for the northeastern areas. And for the uh, Ohio Valley, you will see around two to four inches of rainfall so far for the forecast. We currently do not have any storm surge maps. What once we get to around 48 hours before landfall we will get that out but right now it is pretty early out right now we don't have any forecast for the storm surge here's those arrival times for those winds and as you can see louisiana is going to see those trouble storm force winds by friday 8 a.m and then through friday 8 p.m you will see those hurricane force winds for most of the Louisiana areas. Um, Texas will not see hurricane force winds. You may see some trouble storm force winds, but definitely not hurricane force winds here. This is the whole thing of trouble storm force winds. So mainly the Louisiana area is going to see those hurricane force winds, maybe a little bit of Mississippi. So those areas are going to see the most hurricane force winds. And Texas and Alabama is going to see maybe some trouble with some force winds. If you did enjoy the latest update on Hurricane Delta, be sure to subscribe to the channel if you are new and turn on post notifications so you won't miss a single upload or live stream. Also, make sure to share this video with any friends or family that may be affected by Hurricane Delta. Really get this information out because we are going to see a very serious situation unfolding for the gulf coast once again as we did have a major hurricane hit these areas just a couple weeks ago so we are going to see people are still recovering from hurricane laura from a few weeks ago so really need to get this information out for these people who need to prepare again for another major hurricane making a landfall so make sure to share this video with any friends or family that may be affected once again but anyways stay safe